Hey guys, welcome to today's vlog. It is Tuesday, 11 o'clock. I dropped off Sophie and came home with this little one. She just woke up from nap. Um, today, well, we have just normal day. We have to go to a hospital. She has a doctor appointment. She was on antibiotic for 10 days because she has some mucus in her lung or something like this. So they started her at, on antibiotic for 10 days. Now she has to get back and get checked again. But I feel like she's having a pink eye again. It's her second time because her eyes are a little bit red and then it, there's a green mucus coming out from her eyes. It wasn't like super stuffed in the morning like she couldn't open her eyes but she had this green mucus attached on her um, eyelashes so uh, feeling maybe like probably she's getting um, pink eye again I'm gonna ask her doctor again and and then yeah our appointment is 2.45 we have to leave here by 1:30, which takes it takes about an hour to drive all the way to Beverly Hills. So we have to go to Cedar Sinai, and I'm thinking before that stop by on IKEA because we're still working on Kate's playroom and her their table and the toy basket came in yesterday, and. Uh, my husband's gonna put put them together and I need to grab some stuff from Ikea for their room I'm as I told you I don't know how many times I told you but I'm gonna make a little grocery market and little kitchen and Yeah, I think that's it That's it today. I don't have to pick up Sophie because she's gonna come home with the classmates mom we had um photo shoot last weekend on saturday i did vlog it but i'm not gonna put it up until we receive our photos so that's it for the update i haven't been able to work out i think it's been like five days now i haven't <laughs> gone to the gym because of her like she's just not getting used to it she's not happy at the daycare i mean at the gym daycare she would cry whole time for like 15 minutes and they call me in and tell me like I'm sorry you have to take your kid because she's crying like crazy and it's just wasting time and I've been trying to go at night time but I'm so tired like they go to bed like by nine o'clock and when it by the time i get to the gym it's 10 o'clock and it's like super late and i have to wake up early at six o'clock in the morning just wanted to share this i just had this one quest bar roku road flavor protein bar oh my gosh i don't really like quest bar a lot but i love this one it has this can i can i see it Please, let me show it to them. Okay, she wouldn't give it to me. It's like a brownie with nuts and marshmallows. They're so good. Let me show you inside. Hold on, baby, hold on. This is how it looks. Mmm. What do you think? Yes or no? What do you think? Tell me! Good? A few minutes later
Okay, quick update. Quick update. We just finished at doctor doctor's office, and as I told you that it was a pink eye. I was worried that she get an ear infection, but thankfully, thank goodness, she didn't have ear infection. It's just pink eye. If it was a um, ear infection, then she's gonna go on another antibiotics which is antibiotic after antibiotic so it's kind of i was praying that it's not ear infection which is not so i'm relieved i did have the um eye drop for pink eyes from before it was not even a month ago so she said that i can use that twice a day for a week and it took us about an hour to drive here and this girl having a snack are you having a snack I am so hungry it's three o'clock and wondering should we eat here or should we just head back home before the traffic starts because I am starving but I'm probably think I should head back before traffic starts so We'll see. I'm, I'm gonna need a Starbucks though. I need a Starbucks right now. Hey guys, so I just got home. It's 4.30 right now. Sophie, Zoe slept in the car on the way. Now she's sleeping in her room and we didn't have any traffic, thank goodness. We took the fast track so there were no traffic but on the other different lanes there was lot of traffic and I'm so happy that we're home I didn't even stop by in a Starbucks because she was kind of cranky she was she had enough she was sitting in the car for like two hours so I just didn't even go to a Starbucks just drove home right away and now she's asleep I wanted to share uh, show you guys what I got from Ikea really quick I didn't get a lot of stuff got this little shelves for their books so I'm gonna put four like this like so and then it's gonna I'm gonna put their uh, books and I got this one this is a, a paper drawing paper and this is the holder so it looks like this if it focus okay looks like this and then you put the paper right here and they can just draw on it and tear it and throw it away um i got this rack with a hanger which will i'm gonna hang this one here and then two of this here and i will put her pencils their pencils and brushes for painting and then i'll put the bigger stuff in here so it's gonna be like a little drawing area i got this brushes for them and i got a little painting kit and i'm gonna put them in here so we have a bookshelf right up above their um, drawing table and I'm gonna hang this in between. I'll show you guys when it comes along, but. And then I got this glass. This is for champagne. We don't have any of this, so I got four of these. And then just a short water glass. Our tall, we have tall ones, but we don't have a short one, so. Just got this water glass and then I got this frame so I got two of them what I'm gonna do with this is um, I'm gonna use this I'm not gonna put a picture so I'm gonna put this is for Sophie this is for Zoe I'm gonna put their the hat they were they were in the hospital the first time our like pregnancy pictures like um ultrasounds and then her birth picture when she was a baby and then the clothes she wore like when she come out from the hospital and then her like a name date of birth her weight and all that little stuff I'm gonna write in here and put everything inside and kind of like um, glue it or something 
So it's gonna look like a 3D, like a her birth collection or something like that. And then I'm gonna hang this in their playroom. I thought it was a really cute idea. I have all the stuff that hospital gave us, like her like a brace, her like tags and their hat that they wear the first time and what else? The the picture that we took right after like they was they were born and then I didn't know how like I was keeping it in a little box but I didn't want to keep it like that. I wanted to put it in like some kind of display. So I came up with an idea. I can use this frame and kind of put everything like a really nicely laid it out. And then it's going to be like kind of cute thing. After they grow up, I thought it'd be nice to show them too. So that's my project that I have to do. Woo! <gasps> 